All right, so we are going to learn how to find the greatest common factor or the greatest common divisor. It's the same thing, okay? What you need to know is that a, div a factor are two numbers that will multiply to equal a bigger number, and a divisor is just what you can divide this bigger number by. And since multiplication and division are inverse operations, the greatest common factor and the greatest common divisor are the same number, okay? Now, step one is write each number's prime factorization, okay? So I did a factor tree. Now, I'm not going to go into depth on how to make a factor tree to write a prime factorization. I have another video for that. Um, the link for it is in the comments section of this video. But 32 is 2 times 16. 2 is a prime number, so I stopped there. But 16 is 2 times 8. 8 is 2 times 4, and 4 is 2 times 2. 24 is 12 times 2, 12 is 2 times 6, and 6 is 2 times 3. Okay, so now I can make these prime factorizations. 2, 2, 2, 2, 2, 5, 2. So 32 is 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. And 24 is 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 because I have three twos and a three okay um, next it says to circle the numbers in common in each prime factorization okay so my number on and my 32 factorizations on top my number and my 24 factorizations on the bottom so I have a two up top and a matching two down below I circle them a two up top and another two down below, I circle those. Yet another two up top, another two down below, I circle them. Now, I have another two, but I don't have a two down here other than the ones that have been circled already to match with, so I don't circle it. Same with this one. I can't circle both of these. They don't match because they're on the same row. They both belong to the 32. And I can't circle this three because there's no three up top to match with. Well, then I'm just going to multiply the circled numbers in each row. Okay, so 2 times 2 times 2, that equals 8. And you'll find that when I multiply the ones by the bottom, too, it's the same answer. 2 times 2 times 2 is also 8. Okay, so my greatest common divisor is 8. 8 is the biggest number that I can divide 32 and 24 by. It's also my greatest common factor. It's the largest number that I can multiply by something else to get both 24 and 32. Okay, So that's how you find the GCF or the GCD. Remember, they are the same thing. You just need to write out the prime factorization, match them up, circle the numbers that match up, and multiply the circled numbers. Again, if you're having a tough time um, writing the prime factorization and using a factor tree, Check out my other video. Um, it's called Factoring Numbers Using a Factor Tree. And again, the link is in the video description. Hope that helps.